Hey guys, Tanner69046 here, and I'm back with another episode of Tornado Survival Season 6. I'm not quite sure what the episode number is, but it's in the teens. I know that much. <laughs> Today's episode, we're just going to be doing some chores around the new base location. Um, I know I keep saying these episodes are going to stop of me, you know, not getting a lot done. But the issue here is I have a lot of tedious objectives I need to get done and I don't have enough time in the weeks with school and all that mainly school because school sucks so yeah it also plays into the fact that um, basically uh, I don't know my love for this game just isn't very very thriving right now you know you can only play a game like this for so long and then until you get bored of it. But for today, we are here and ready to go. Uh, wood. Leaves. Wood. Wood. Um, so yeah, so today's episode is going to be a cleanup episode. Also, I have a few things I want to talk about. Um, I'm going to low-key talk about them in this episode because I don't want to get myself into trouble. But, um, uh, yeah, so... We'll go ahead and start out here. Um, food, I forgot to put this in there. For one, this mod's about to get a lot more interesting. Koros is doing an update for it. Um, it's going to introduce sandstorms, it's going to fix a few bugs that we had. Um, it might even allow us to, um, uh, to use sponge for a fan server. I hope that happens. I, I can't promise anything. Right now, all I know is Sponge doesn't work. But I think he mentioned that he found a fix for it, hopefully. So that, that'd be great to have fixed, of course. So yeah, um, look forward to that maybe with the new update when it comes out. And like I said, it's got sandstorms, which if you live by a desert, you can get screwed in this game. So that's always fun. So yeah, basically the sandstorm, it has yellow particles, kind of like the clouds or whatever, but they're on the ground, kind of like a fog, but again, it's sand particles in the air, and it picks up sand blocks and moves them around, kind of like it would in a real sandstorm. And then, depending on how big the sandstorm is, is how far outside of the biome that the sand is going to go. So, you know. I don't know if we're affected. I don't know how close we are to a sand or a desert biome, but who knows. Um, I have to fix the mod because I have to configure the settings. The storms aren't spawning like they should. I'll do that when the new update comes out. Um, right here. The question is, did I make another chest for gravel? Yes. Where is it? Dirt. Railway wood. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Ah, uh, food stone. Did I put gravel? Aha, uh -huh, I did put gravel in there. Uh, is this going to go in there? Yes, it can. Um, food. So, yeah, that's something to look forward to with this mod is the series is going to get a lot more exciting. Whenever that's released, we'll... We'll obviously go and check out one of the sandstorms when they happen. We're just not going to ignore that aspect of the mod. Um, this is the localized weather mod. It's not just tornado survival. So, you know, the focus is tornadoes. But we, we can we can take a look at the other stuff. I don't know where I should put this die at. Hmm. Gray die. Light railway glass. I guess just put it in there with the glass. Um, also, I want to talk about the, the kind of small, not really small, um, incident that happened this week. So, essentially, I uploaded an apology. Well, for one, let's start from the very beginning. I uploaded a video releasing the download of G Disasters to the public. It was an old download from July, a beta version. And I wanted it to give it to you all, so I did. I can't put this. Can I? Yeah, I can. So yeah, I did that. 
And that video was shortly taken down for copyright. Woo. This. Because that's what happens when you upload files that are copyrighted. I didn't know they were copyrighted though was the issue. So as you can assume, I shortly found out, hey, which way are you moving? That way, huh? It's tempting to chase that. We might chase it after I finish moving this stuff. Um, so yeah, as I shortly found out, G Disasters is copyrighted. Yeah, yeah, that's right. A decade old game, an add-on to a decade old game is copyrighted. Wow, right? I know. So yeah, that video gets taken down for copyright. The owner tells me, hey, we are going to seek legal action about this. He consults his lawyer that he apparently has for a um, decade old game. <laughs> and apparently I could be up to my neck in fines of like $700 at the lowest, which it would most likely be at the lowest for one, because I wasn't aware of the copyright, and two, I was not trying to put any harm towards the mod, but I I was still apparently legally responsible for it. So yeah, that's that's that. So I definitely could have been fined for that. That's something I... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. That's something I would definitely would like to avoid, is being fined or sued or whatever. I didn't want to have to do that. Because not only is there the penalties for being sued, you also have to get a lawyer to defend yourself to get that low rate. And the price for lawyers ain't cheap. I'll just tell you that right now. So I definitely wouldn't want this to go to court. So yeah, there's that. So after we did that, um, he said if I make an apology video... He will not seek legal action against me. So, I had to do that. And as you may be aware, I don't apologize that much. So, there's that. <laughs> I may have apologized a total of two times during my entire channel lifetime. Like, legit apologized. Maybe that. <laughs> Maybe less, to be honest, because that's just how I am. I just don't like to apologize. Um, so, yeah, that was kind of tough for me to have to do that. Man, we really are going to get to chase this thing, aren't we? Uh, seats. Okay, yep. We can go catch up with it. Um, so, yeah, we're going to go chase this while I continue to talk. So, yeah, he said if I upload an apology video, I'll be fine. I did. He didn't like it. I took that one down. I made another one. And that was enough, I guess, at this point. I do not think he's going to seek legal action against me. But at this point, after this, he said, Yeah, yeah, I won't sue all this crap. I avoided I avoided dying or whatever. Um, then I get home from school the next day. And, um, what do you call it? Um, I get another copyright strike. I thought it was just like a repeat notice from the day before. But no, they took down my other G-Disasters video. And that was not going to fly because that one was fair use. I wasn't releasing the mod in that one or anything. It, it, literally the only thing in it was the title had G-Disasters and the G-Disasters add-on was being used in the video. But that's fair use. That is not That is not anything illegal. That, that is just... I shouldn't have gotten a copyright strike for that. So then he removed that. I didn't have to go through the process of trying to repeal that copyright strike. Because that would have sucked. Because having two copyright strikes would have been dangerous. Because I literally could have gotten flagged for anything. And then boom, channel gone. Interestingly enough, I have never gotten a copyright strike before this incident. So, yeah. Um, imagine all the other conflicts of Tornado Wars combined together. And, yeah, just put that all together. And that that's what you get with this one. It's our flag that got hit. Where are you at? Storm. With an F1. Moving this way. Come back, I want pictures. <laughs> it's a strengthening F1. This is rare. <laughs> Come here. Ugh. We gotta chase this thing. So yeah, this is the biggest conflict I've ever had to deal with on my channel. Mainly because I was gonna have to seek legal action in defense. It's a huge difference between being the attacker and the defender in legal action. So that's that's for sure. 
So, luckily I dodged a bullet there and I didn't have to deal with that. And, uh, yeah, I probably won't be releasing any copyrighted material for the next few entirety of my lifetime because I don't really know if I want to deal with that again. That wasn't a fun situation. So, yeah. I'll probably, for the most part, other than what I've said, I'm going to keep silent on this subject just because that's going to be the the smart thing to do in a situation like this you usually don't want to have to um don't have to increase matters worse i just want you all to be informed as always i want you all to be informed with stuff like this we're getting closer gosh it's still moving quite a bit away so yeah that's 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 all i'm gonna say on that um i'm not gonna drag this out or anything i'm just gonna cut to the point i messed up it's my fault and i'm sorry so moving on from that, let's chase this tornado, why don't we? Uh, let's get over this hill. Should get a better view of it. I think the particles are loaded in. Right now I can't see much through these trees. It's like we're in Alabama. East Alabama at that, because there's mountains there. Aha. Oh yeah, we're closing in. Watch it pick up right as it does this. As, as soon as I get a decent tornado, watch it just die. Oh yeah, it's an F1 right now. Oh, great, it's over water. Come on. Dang it. Alright, so we got an F1. Finally, we saw a tornado stronger than an F-0. Come on, let's get closer. I don't have any wood on me. Or I would go chase it. Ha ha! Alright, that's that's your chasing for today. I can't, I can't chase ocean storms. I don't have a boat. This is gonna wrap around for me. Ooh, I could almost go over there. Hey, we've had tornadoes over there before. Alright, well, it's weakening, of course. Um, hopefully he picks up this glitch where you can see that through blocks or whatever. Look, if I go like that. Oh, yeah, look, it's right there. Gone, there, gone, there, gone, there. <laughs> Alright, so that's going to be it for today's episode. We got a good tornado in, and we did a few tedious tasks. Look for a live stream tonight. I don't know if I'm going to or not. I might go hunting. I might live stream. Who knows? Um, and I'll have more information on that, of course, tonight. So if I'm live streaming, I'll post a video announcing it. If I'm not live streaming, uh, well, you can probably figure that out because there won't be an announcement video. So yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. Like, comment, subscribe if you all enjoyed. I hope you all did enjoy it. Um, leave any comments or, or you know questions, suggestions, all of that good stuff. I'll be sure to look at it. Might not respond, but I will look at it. So that's going to do it for this episode. Bye!